Now we're going to take a look at measure 62, which begins right over here, and we're going to work through 67. So in the first part, the left hand, if you look carefully, the left hand's going to play the downbeat. It's also going to cross over to play this B flat. So basically, the left hand's playing B flat, B flat, and then here, <clears throat> the left hand's playing the E flat, then the right hand plays the D flat. So let's do the left hand by itself, which has this. One, crossover, B flat, and then E flat, just like that. Once again, one, two, three. The left hand does exactly the same thing in the following bar, but it does it an octave higher. One, two, three, like that. Again, one, two, three. The right hand is just playing what sounds like a diminished triad, C flat, D natural, F. It does the same thing up an octave, and then it ends on a D natural. So the right hand is one, E, and a, two, E, and a, three, and four. Does the same thing again up an octave on the next bar. One, E, and a, two, E and a uh, three and four. So we put that together, it sounds like this. One E and a uh, two E and a uh, three and four and one E and a uh, two E and a uh, three and four and and if you work that up in speed, it's going to sound kind of cool like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And eventually, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's start slowly and work it up gradually. Now let's take a look at this next section here. Again, we're looking for patterns to simplify the music. If we look at the left hand, the left hand now is playing the fourth sixteenth of every group of 16th notes. It's always playing on the A uh of each beat. One, E, and A, uh, two, E, and A, uh, three, E, and A, uh, four, E, and A. Uh. It starts in a B flat, and we're looking for patterns, and I want you to notice B flat, G sharp, F sharp, that's the three black keys, then it goes down D sharp, C sharp, two black keys, then down to the three black keys again, two black keys, three black keys, to the G sharp, like that. <clears throat> and actually, he does go to the final black key here on the downbeat. So the left hand is really just walking down the black keys like this. Like that. Okay? So let's just practice that. And we'll just do it on the downbeats for simplicity. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. it won't actually be on the downbeat except for that last chord. As far as the right hand's concerned, let's see what the pattern is here. They're always descending triads. Okay, if we look closely, they're all white keys. So take a look. B D F A C E white keys like that. So we just think about the root of the chords. B A G and then he goes down E, D, and again, C flat, A, G, back down to E, D, and again, C flat, A, and then G happens here in the following measure. Okay? And if we compare it to the left hand to see how this fits in place, the left hand plays B flat for the black keys, right? The right hand thumb is a half step above the black key and they follow along in this way. Same thing here, when we go to the two black keys, three black keys, two black keys, three black keys. That's the pattern, so you want to get comfortable with that first.
and then we can actually play it as written. Okay, so I'm already in position. One, E, and A. Uh, then I'm going to go down. Two, E, and A. Uh, three, E, and A. Uh, like that. One, E, and A. Uh, two, E, and A. Uh, three, E, and A. Uh. I want to get used to that. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, E, and A. Uh. Okay. That's how it goes. Let's take it slow. One, E, and A. Uh, two, E, and A. Uh, three, E, and A. Uh, four, E, and A. Uh. One, E, and A. Uh, two, E, and A. Uh, three, E, and A. Uh, four, E, and A. Uh, one, E, and A. Uh, two, E, and A. Uh, three, E, and A. Uh, four, E, and A. Uh, one, E, and A. Uh, does the same thing up an octave. Two, E, and A. Uh, and then the left hand comes back. Three, O, let, four, O. Back to that rhythm there. So take a listen to that measure. One E and A, uh, two E and A, uh, three O, oh, let four O, oh, let. And let me demonstrate this whole section for you. So it sounds like this in a medium tempo. One E and A, uh, two E and A, uh, three and four and one E and A, uh, two E and A, uh, three and four and. One E 